Alright, and uh, welcome to another 10 minute review. Today we're going to be checking out Death Race on the NES. It came out in 1990, and it is a unlicensed Nintendo game, as in it didn't have the Nintendo seal of quality, the N Nintendo seal of approval. Um, well, mainly for its uh, depiction of violence here, so let's just check this out and see what we got going on here. We got one player or two players, so. Alright, so we can pick a level here. Uh, we got rookie, amateur, professional, world class. I am, since they don't have noob class, I'll take rookie. Alright, so it says, uh, able to outrun and outgrow your helpless victims, outrun, outgun. <laughs> Your helpless victims. The Kill Roy earns its name with many bloodied front grills. Ooh. Alright, so you can start picking your guns, your engines, your chassis, your tires, or your missiles. Let's start with... I have $25,000 to buy with. So I can pick between two different kinds, or four different kinds of guns here. We got the Acme, the Gatlin, the Spandau, and the Uzi. Spandau is very goth, very angsty. Uh, we'll just go with a, let's see, the, the Acme. It's probably the cheapest. Engine I can pick, turbo, nitrous, nuclear, or fusion. Um, let's get a nitrous one, why not? Let's see what we got. Okay, so our chassis, I can pick either the Kilroy, the Cat's Paw, the Panther, or the Pitbull. Played this earlier, there really isn't you kind of look all the same, so I'm going to stick with the Kilroy, the Lamborghini looking one. Uh, tires. We have cutters, bashers, slicers, and dicers. Sounds very gory. Uh, we'll just go with the bashers and missiles. I've got shell, armored, fusion, and nuclear. And I can press start to pick them. Nope, sorry. I picked start to pick them. And uh, select to pick how many you want to buy. And I'll pick 25 armor. Alright, and you can modify, repair, so you can modify your tire friction. This is, there's a lot of little tweaking devices. I won't get into it too much. You can repair once you start playing and get, or getting uh, shot at. You can pay to have your car repaired so you can continue on to the next level and now we exit so here we go level one uh, I'm a rookie in San Diego it's very very catchy upbeat music for what, what we're about to get into so all right pressing start and uh, this is it guys you look for people to run over and you squish them and uh, now, I played this a little bit. This was a bit the first for me. I'd never heard of this game. Well, take that back. I had heard of the, the the original game called Death Race, which is which was an arcade game back in the 70s and was looked upon as being very gory. Although we had worse graphics than this, and but people, it was the the concept, the idea that made people really upset about it. So. My job here, the, the controls here, by the way, um, no matter what direction you're going in, you press up to go forward. So even if I'm t I turn left and right to go in circles, and I push forward. So I can direct myself. I don't, I don't push myself in the direction that I'm going. I'm actually pushing up to continue on. So I have, the, nope, now I have this helicopter at me he's trying to shoot so let me let me uh, see I can shoot one of my missiles with the B button a button seems to do nothing at this point I bl tried to blow up my oh I don't have that grill is I'm already gonna die here see I played this earlier trying to get the sense of what this game was even all about and uh, I did a lot better I should have probably recorded while I was playing the first time this thing is right on my butt, but the idea here is that you have to find there. You have to find that. F oh, you have to find that flag. And as you get, as you start to die, this thing is all on me. As you start to die, your con 
Yeah, no, this isn't gonna work out. As you continue on... Man, oh man. See, my... My control is real weak after about... Start, uh, there we go. Okay, guys. Let's just start this one more, one more time. <laughs> Alright, take two. So go through, and I'll continue with Rookie. And, uh, we'll stick to what we got. And exit out of here. Since it didn't really do me any good the last time. Alright, so now, see that gate up to the top here? We gotta go get that flag to open it and that'll take us to the next level and all what we're doing here is just upping our kill count by finding as many pedestrians as we can and uh, as we get better we get more money kill more people we get more points and uh, let me just get head down real quick to the corner want to get there we go and we get get the flag here if I can Maneuvering is control. Ugh. All right, let's just stop and aim, and I'll take it slow here. Let's see, this is. There we go. Now, once you got the flag, you can leave. You can leave the area. Um, although you you want to get as many people killed as possible. Although, the longer you stay, the more chances you have of getting shot by the helicopter and whatnot. So, kill as many people as possible. Now I'm getting shot at. Let me go... There we go. Go into the gate there. Tells me I killed five people. I had zero silo kills. I didn't see any of the enemy, uh, which I didn't kill, and one flag. So I got a bonus of 54 points for a total of 233 points and $5,700 in money. All right, now let's uh, let's change our guns here. Oh, I don't. Know. My gun speed will be uh, 13. I can bring it up that way. And let's get those tires changed out. Let me let me buy. Yeah, let me buy some bashers. Maybe I get some better uh, dealing. Uh, I'll buy a bunch of uh, shell bombs here. 17, 18. I'm pressing the select button to do so. Alright. So I got a few of those. And let's see. I don't need to repair my guy right now. Um, no, it's not letting me. So exit out and go on to the next level. Now we're heading east on our way to Phoenix. Uh, leaving a bloody trail of uh, corpses along the way. Alright, I mean, this really doesn't change much. Uh, I guess, I mean, ob for obvious reasons, this was, this was a uh, an unlicensed Nintendo game. Nintendo would, of America would never uh, get a game like this, although in 1990 somehow it got released. It's probably on some um, bootleg type deal. I've, I've rented, when I was a kid, I rented some some bootleg uh, Nintendo games that were unlicensed from the guy down the street. It wasn't from a, like a blockbuster. It was like a video store guy. And he, he must have gotten from a dealer a bunch of different Nintendo games. But, I mean, I played, uh, if, you've ever, if you're familiar with, uh, oh, there's all kinds of, let me get this crap. There's all kinds of unlicensed Nintendo games, but I uh, I played quite a few bloody ones. Um, uh, can't even think of the name of it. Oh my God, come on. Ugh. Well, game over, <laughs> guys. This is really about it. It's kind of a weird game. It's not much to this. Uh, you go and you squish people and you blow them up. The controls are really, really. Ugh. I couldn't I couldn't even get a hang the hang of this very much. So. Uh, that's really about it, guys. <sighs> what do I say about Death Race, huh? Well, for a game, if I was 12 years old, and this came out, this came out when I was 12, uh, my 12-year-old self would have loved this. My adult self does not does not care for it. The controls are real kludgy. You gotta really try to figure out what's going on. It's the same game. You just seen it. I didn't change uh, even change background sprites. They were the same green. 
And you just went from town to town, killing people, running them over, and, and shooting your enemy. It's an interesting game. Uh, I've never seen any any of them actually in the wild or any hard copies of this, but they they do exist. This is a this is one of these bootleg things that there was out there, but I had never seen it before. So if you want to try it, check it out, see if you like it better, leave some comments about it, because I've never even never even played it before. But it's not too bad. I mean, maybe if I got the hang of it, I played it earlier. I was getting a lot further, but I guess just for this run, I can't can't quite hack it, guys. So. Yeah, Death Race by American Game Cartridges Incorporated. Check it out, guys. Go and see it.